the second conference the second press conference in 2024 of the Anti-Corruption Commission has updated journalists that a total of 8.4 billion leons was recovered from the Sahelian Roads Authority and the Ministry of Finance through fact-checking and effects of, of the Commission. Commissioner Ben Kelfala also gave an update of the CLACs of the clerk of parliament's wife who received the sum of 151 million old leon salary for a period of 19 months she did not work for since yesterday since the camera now reports giving updates to the press on cases concerning the public anti-corruption commissioner francis ben kelfala made it clear that their commission does their work through certain procedures and parameters the government, he went on, has been very magnanimous by giving the commission the responsibility of fighting corruption of which he had been very committed to his duty. A total sum of 8.4 billion oleums were disclosed to the press which was recovered from the Sierra Leone Road Authority and the Ministry of Finance saga in less than three weeks of their investigations. What you see here and what you see back there and we even have another 1.8 billion euros in the account, not so? 1.8 billion. billion euros in an account. All of it we have recovered from these people. Totaling 6 point... About 8.4 8 billion euros. Imagine people stole 8.4 billion euros from Sierra Leone. If you don't want to cry, I want to cry. Sorry. <laughs> <laughs> 8.4 billion euros. Don't you feel like crying? <laughs> Painful. The good news is, if even you don't think that things are happening in Sierra Leone, but I know, because we are all now adults here. We have lived in this country for years, not so. Yeah. There has never been a time when somebody has stolen even one billion years from this country and paid it back. <laughs> is there anybody here who wants to remind me of a time? But today, consistently, we have been bringing back money stolen from the public, including what you see here. Eight point, what again? Eight point four billion euros. We have recovered every penny of it from them. Among the cases of public concern was the Parliament saga, where the clerk of Parliament employed his wife, who was not going to work for 19 months. Ben Kelfala confirmed that it is not forbidden to recruit family members, but due process should be followed without unfair advantage. As of 24th January, the commissioner noted they have recovered 151 million oleons for Madam Abiatu Parana Tarawali. I had a meeting with the president yesterday. And we have discussed what will happen administratively. Let me repeat again, we don't have control over the president or what he can do. And we do not dictate his work. And certainly, I, Francis Ben Kaifara, as Commissioner of Anti-Corruption Commission of Sierra Leone, is not the Chief Executive of his house here. There is a President, and his role is very spelled out in the Constitution, and nobody should expect me to usurp that role. But he's a very, very listening man. And I had a meeting with him yesterday, and I know that he's going to take action. In respect of value. We have recovered 151 million oleos, which is 151,000 new now, not so, from the wife, Madame Abibatu Parana Trawali, which is now with us. It is not part of this money that you see here. But she has fully paid 151 million euros, which represents her salary for 19 months that she did not work. Another sum of 1.6 billion was stolen out of banking system by one Frederick Coker, who was reported to have left the shores of Sierra Leone for overseas with his family. Investigations are ongoing on other issues of public interest. The commission says they will continue to ensure they fight corruption for the betterment of the nation. For SBC News, Cynthia Kamara reporting.
in a significant step towards enhanced border security and migration management the honorable minister of internal affairs and chief immigration officer officially launched the migration